Hi people, wonder shall never end. Hey, no be smart, no before we proceed. Yeah, welcome back to my channel and my page. I greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video. We are still on the gist from the palace of Uni of Ife. My people, information reaching us right now allegedly is that uh, Uni of Ife's wives have been crying, especially Olo Ritobi. You know, one problem that, uh, or one thing that is going to be a very big problem to Toby, if all we are hearing is true, is this uh, jealousy, or wanting to be Queen Naomi, or wanting to take Queen Naomi's position. It is obvious that Toby thought that the moment she gave birth to these twins, that uh, Oni of Ife is going to forget about Queen Naomi and Prince Tadenikawo and focus on her and uh, the babies. Yes, so... But now, it's, it looks as if she is uh, disappointed, and it is getting too hard on her. You know, one, thing she, one mistake that they keep making is that they forget the fact that Oni of Ife is the first love to Queen Naomi. Yes, and Queen Naomi is his first wife. Queen Naomi is the mother of his first son. Queen Naomi is the love of his life, whether they like it or not. You know, the earlier they realize this, I'm sure they will stop having problems in this marriage with the king. Seriously. Because they cannot change the fact that Oni loved Queen Naomi. And considering all that we have been hearing, how they were able to maneuver things with their jazz and everything to enter the palace, maybe they thought that if they use jazz to enter, that it is going to continue like that. That is if what we are hearing happens to be true. Because we do not live with them. All of this information, they are all alleged information. Now, they said the reason why they are crying this time, especially Toby. We heard that only of Ife bought a house for Toby. We did not hear that Kwenami cried or fight the king over the fact that he bought a house for Toby. The only person that we heard that complained or was bitter about the fact or happens to be Ashley. And the, the reason is because Ashley had been begging the king to acquire a house for her in Lagos and the king had been refusing. Kwenami did not fight it. Because when Naomi already know that only of Ife is married to these women, and no matter what, they are his wife. Unless he choose today to say, okay, I not do again. But until then, they remain his wife. So anything that he does for his wife shouldn't be a problem to her. You know, but I don't understand why is it that any time the king does something for Queen Naomi, it becomes a serious problem for these people. If a man have first wife and later had... Uh, six wife extra. If he wants to do something that requires that it is only one person that he will do it for, he will first he will first he will choose his first wife. You know. So the problem right now is that they said only of if uh, 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 gave Queen Naomi and on, only Queen Naomi the diplomatic passport. And from what we heard, this diplomatic passport uh, signifies that you are one of the MVVBPI as in the most important personnel, let's say number one citizen or among the first class citizen of a country. So with this uh, for, uh, a diplomatic passport, uh, certain places, maybe protocols will, will be ignored and all of that. And among the wives, the only person that will get this thing happens to be with Naomi and the king gave it to her and it's becoming a very big problem. Why? Because they think they can, they can fight the love. They think they can fight it. The more they try to fight these two people, the more they push them together, the more they will get hurt. I mean, the wives. If Toby, if, if all this gist that we are hearing is true, Toby needs to go and uh, 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 call herself meeting or look for an elder who will tell her the truth and start listening to her or him. Because he need, she needs someone to tell her that, look, you are married to this man. He is taking care of you. But you see, uh, this his first wife, Queen Naomi, you can, never, you can never compete with her. Even though you see yourself as a co-wife to her. But see that love? The love is not there. The king married you as second-hand property. But the king married Queen Naomi first-hand, as in... Eh? 
uh, let me tell you, uh, when I hear this, that they were crying and Toby was carrying it on top of her head, I said, Toby, I beg, go and rest, oh. Go and rest before you be busy fighting with Naomi and they will be busy striking you and your babies from the palace and you might not even know where what hit you comes from. You might be saying, hey, Queen Naomi, this, Queen Naomi, that. The energy that you are fighting with Naomi with, use it to guard yourself and your babies because you need it. If all we are hearing from that palace of Ilefe, kingdom happens to be truth, what you should be thinking about is the safety of you and your babies because even your co-wives are not happy. Some of them who said that the king must go and do a DNA test, do you think that they're happy with you and they are suggesting such a thing to your husband? That should be your problem and not fighting someone who is not fighting you. That diplomatic uh, passport can only be given to her and not to you. Even if you use jazz to want to collect it, even if it gets your hand, my, maybe by jazz or anything, it will still go away from you and go to the right, rightful person. Yes, yeah, so why I said this is, is this. When Onori Madam enters the palace, only of if made her, Yeyolua. Is it not true? And that is because maybe her jazz was very effective then. But because those things expired, when it expired, we, heard, we also heard that the king suspended her from being the Yolua. And the moment when Naomi returns back to the palace, she will take her rightful position. And this person will be in shame. Because one thing is this, instead of giving somebody that right and uh, along the line you take it away from her, uh, it's, it's better that you don't give it to her at all. You know? So when I hear this, I say, now nah, wow, now nah, wow, Toby, now nah, wow, if it is true, uh -huh. Because, like I told you, these are all alleged information. I do not live in the palace, okay? I know they live for palace. Now, blogger, I be. Uh -huh. I am just a blogger. When I get all of, all of this information, when I gather them from social media, I'll come here and share with you. So, they are not for stand information, okay? So, they said Toby had been crying. That after giving the king a set of babies, a boy and a girl, that he is not happy, he is not pleased. The king is happy. If you watch the videos during this period that Toby gave birth to these twins, the, the king is super happy, very much happy. And he is happier, or let's say happiest. <laughs> yes, when he went and bought a house for Toby and the babies. The king is happy. And he is doing everything he can do as a husband. But he cannot take away the love that he has for Queen Naomi, if that's your mission. So guys, I don't know what you think about it. Tell me what you think about it on the comment section, okay? And share this, give it, uh, share this video, give my video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and follow my page and follow my account. Bye. I love you guys.